Time now for a check of your North Central Washington weather forecast. Hope you had a great weekend. I'll tell you, it's really turning all over North Central Washington. I'm talking about the colors turning everywhere. This is a shot up at Lake Wenatchee, and it is gorgeous up that way. That, that way. I took a trip over to Seattle over the weekend, went over on Stevens and back on Snoqualmie, and I'll tell you, the scenery is just phenomenal right now. And it wasn't a bad day today. We did see kind of a mix of clouds and sun, and I hope you enjoyed the temperatures today because the bottom is dropping out of our temperatures as we get into Tuesday, 49 for Wenatchee Tuesday, 44 the high temperature on Wednesday, and look at our lows, 28, 26, 25. Yeah, it is going to get winter-like as we get into the middle and especially end of the week. And we're talking some snow, too. It's coming our way. Mountain passes, a very sketchy driving situation from Tuesday night into Wednesday night. And we're talking all of our local passes. Stevens, Blewett, I think Snoqualmie will be included in that tomorrow. We're talking moderate to heavy snow possible. And we're not left out of that picture either. In fact, we should prepare for snow here in the lowlands. There is a winter weather advisory that will go in place at 11 o'clock tomorrow night, and it'll run until 11 o'clock Wednesday night. We could see about one to three inches of snow in some locations, probably around the Waterville Plateau, northern Columbia Basin. You're probably going to see some snowfall as well, and we will know much more about this winter storm when we get together again tomorrow. So be prepared for this weather as it moves in on us over the next 24 hours. 62, we're going to wish it was 62 when we get into the middle of the week. That was our unofficial high today. 56 is where we should be for this time of year, and 69 is our record high, and that was set in 1992. Low this morning, way above where we should be, 46. 38 is now our normal low temperature, our record low, 29, and that was set back in 1980. Sunrise this morning, 731, and the sun sets tonight for us before 6 o'clock now at 550. All right, let's take a look now at your Tuesday high temperatures, and you're going to notice a difference right away. 10 degrees for most of us, most uh, less for most of us, mostly cloudy, and 53 for Moses Lake, Anna Freda, 52 in Quincy, 51 here in Wenatchee, a little bit cooler in the higher elevations, Lake Wenatchee, 47, and Leavenworth, a high temperature tomorrow of only about 50 degrees. All right, tonight's weather, mostly cloudy skies. We are seeing a large area of high high pressure out in the Pacific, but at the same time, cold air and another storm system moving across Canada, that will bring some clouds for us tonight. A little chilly too, low temperatures in the low 40s, and there is that area of low pressure that's really going to kick the storminess up. Not so much in the morning or even in the early afternoon, but here we go, late afternoon, early evening. Snow level 2,000 feet, a 90% chance of rain and snow for us tomorrow. Wednesday, that snow level is going to drop down to 1,300 feet. We'll have a 60% chance of the wet stuff. Remember that winter weather advisory in place through Wednesday into Wednesday night. High temperatures only in the lower 40s on Wednesday. For Thursday, things will calm down a little bit, but we're still going to see plenty of clouds still from that area of low pressure. It's going to be unseasonably cool on Thursday. Highs again only in the low 40s. And folks, we're talking low temperatures in the mid to upper 20s. So it is going to be cool. Rain and snow in the morning for Friday, partly cloudy by afternoon. High temperatures in the low 40s. Big football game at Eastmont High School against Moses Lake on Friday. Bundle up if you're heading to Wildcat Stadium for Friday. Kicking off our weekend now, look at all the clear skies, but it's kind of deceiving. Notice our airflow still coming down from the northwest. That is going to keep us unseasonably cool on Saturday. High temperatures again, only in the low to mid 40s, even with all that sunshine. And then for Sunday, once again, not much change. Sunny, still chilly at the end of our forecast. High temperatures only in the mid 40s. All right, let's take a look at your seven day forecast now. 
39 overnight tonight. We haven't been in the 30s for a long time. 51 are high tomorrow. A 90% chance of a rain-snow mix. And we do have that winter weather advisory that will go Tuesday into Wednesday. Cloudy at a 60% chance of rain mixed with snow for Wednesday and only 43. And we're going to stay about 43 for Thursday and Friday. There is a chance for a morning, maybe rain and snow shower on Friday. Partly cloudy by afternoon. High temperature of 43 and then lots of sunshine for our upcoming weekend, but chilly. High temperatures then only in the mid 40s.